Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Omar, from buymeaniphone.com. Today I have another product I want to show you. This is something that was sent to me free for review by Skosh, and this is the Skosh RH1056MD headphones. And these are their, uh, their new uh, over-the-ear headphones that Skosh has been releasing under the Realm series. And so these retail for $199. And uh, let's go ahead and talk about the things that come with the box or inside the box, and then we'll, do, uh, we'll start discussing the headphones themselves. So as you can see, a couple of different accessories are included in here. We have the, uh, the one fourth uh, inch adapter, gold plate adapter that does come with it. Also comes with a PC adapter as well, so it splits the, uh, the microphone and the audio into two different uh, lines. And you can use it for gaming or uh, for voice over IP as well. So it's kind of nice that they put that in there. It includes a carabiner clip, unless you want, in case you want to clip the uh, hard case pouch to your backpack, you can hook that up onto there. You can clip it on there as well. It also includes a microfiber cleaning cloth, so you can keep your headphones nice and clean. These are like real gloss, uh, chrome looking uh, headphones, so this will definitely do a good job keeping all the fingerprints and such off of there. It is also includes two set of cords, and these are six and a half foot flat cable, real nice flat cable cords. This is the regular one here with a, has a, an angled plug right here at the end of it. And so the other one is a straight plug, and these are also small recess plugs, so if you do have iPhone iPhones in like I say a smaller case that has a small opening like say an OtterBox or whatever these are these plugs will fit in there real nicely. So this is the regular cord that it comes with. It also includes uh, a cord with a tap line control that Scotia offers on their headphones, which is really nice. And so this basically allows you to control the uh, audio uh, to to play, to pause, next, previous. You can adjust the volume with these, and you can also answer phone calls. So if, right here is a microphone, so you can talk on your uh, on these headphones while you're using them as well. So when you're listening to music. You can answer the phone call. When you don't answer your phone call, switch over and back to playing music again. So this also has gold-plated uh, tips on it, and this is a, also an angled uh, tip right there as well. Okay, so those are included in there. Put this to the side. And it also has a, a soft pouch, uh, travel pouch, if you, want, if you want to carry your headphones separately, and it does include this hard pouch as well. So they, it does have both of them. This is a little bit bigger, so it might be harder to fit this inside like a backpack or a smaller bag. And if you just want to take the headphones out and put it in here, this pouch will be real good. It's pretty thick thickly padded so it'll do a good job of making sure you don't get any scratches or any kind of small light damage to the headphones so you can keep those in there as well. So it kind of nice that they throw both of those in there, okay? So let's put these things to the side and let's uh, pop open the, the bag here and let's see what comes inside here. So as you can see, this is a real nice hard protective that pouch right there. There's the headphones right there. Also, all those pieces that I just showed you right now, they can all go into this little pouch right here. It has a Velcro on the back. And you can either keep it in here or you can leave it out, depending on whatever you want to do. But all those pieces, will they can fit in here pretty smoothly. And you can still close it with the headphones inside, so that's kind of nice. So let's take these out of here. Push this to the side. So guys, um, I, you know, this is uh, Scotia's first dive into over-ear headphones. Everything they've released uh, up until now were just earbuds. And I have to say, guys, they've probably I think they've hit a home run with these. These are really really nice over-ear headphones. And I'm just going to address it right now because I know I'm gonna get tons of comments and questions and people are gonna ask me, Omar, how do these rate against Beats by Dre, let's say Studios? And I'll go on record right now to say, guys, if you guys are on the fence of whether or not to buy these or Beats by Dre Studios, spend your, save your $100 and buy these. These are way better as far as, I think I still think they look just as stylish as the Beats. The audio quality is much better than the Beats. Beats are gonna thump, thump your head off with the bass, but these have really good thump and bass as well. Plus everything else is, is nice and, uh, and equalized, so, so the mids and the highs are still gonna sound really awesome. So for those of you that are on the whole Beats by Dre kick, forget the Beats by Dre, you need to check out these, uh, the Realm series headphones from Skosh, really nice headphones. So look, before we talk about going more into audio quality, let's just talk about comfort, okay? So as you guys can see, it's over the ear headphones. These are the big, big daddies right here that go over the ear and they basically cup your ear and keep that sound nice and isolated in there. These are folding headphones like I showed you, so they travel really well. They do have steel, stainless steel hinge, on there, so real strong, feel real nice and tight. Has nice, a gl nice gloss, like a piano black finish to them. They also have a white version that's pretty nice as well. And a little chrome or gunmetal style ends of here. And if this looks familiar, Scotia has a Realm series uh, speakers that they offer. And I guess, uh, uh, what was it? Vehicle accessories. And so this kind of looks real similar to that Realm series. So in here we have genuine leather. So you have genuine leather straps on here. Genuine leather on the cups, it has nice foam, so it's really comfortable to go over here. It feels real comfortable when you're, when you're on your head. They're pretty, they're not too heavy, but they do, they do feel heavy enough to where they feel sturdy. They don't feel cheap, okay, but they are still light. They're not going to be weighing your head down too much. The one thing I wish that kind of maybe would tweak a little bit is like the, the way they, they adjust and the movement. It's just kind of, as you can see here, it kind of just moves around a little bit. 
I kind of wish that they're a little more a little more solid when, in their movements. But so there's basically a hinge that goes like this, and then there's a hinge that goes back and forth, and that's kind of how they just adjust your ears. Not a really big deal, but uh, just some one of those really tiny details that kind of make them would make them seem a little more a little more flush, a little more uh, finished, I guess you could say. So because these kind of just jiggle in place. So not a super big deal, like I said, but something to consider. Uh, also, as you guys can see, the cord it does plug into the bottom right here, and this is the left headphone. I kind of wish it had plugs on both ends. That way, if you want to swap them out, you could do that. But on this one, it's right on the uh, it's on the left side here. So when you you can detach it, if something happens to the cord or breaks, you still have two sets of cords. You can swap it out and use the other one. Or if you want to buy your own set of cords and use something different with it, I guess you could do that as well if you really wanted to. So these fe feature a 40 uh, millimeter drivers, which is pretty standard for this size headphones. And um, they sound really good, guys. Also, just want to make sure I mention this, that they are Siri compatible. You know, those of you guys that have the iPhone 4S, um, you know, a lot of headphones, some of them headphones are not working with Siri. These actually are compatible with Siri, okay? So as far as comfort goes, they're very comfortable. They're very easy to put on the head that they don't feel, you know, heavy, bulky or anything. Very nice, um, very good quality. And all the parts and everything, it does not feel cheap. I've, I've played with cheap head plastic headphones. These do not feel cheap. These feel like $200 headphones, for sure. So let's talk about sound quality. Like I said, these will beat Beats by Dre any day of the week, especially the studios. I'm not sure, I've never tried out the Beats by Dre Pro. They're some of the more expensive, even more expensive uh, lines of headphones, but as far as the studios go, I would go with these headphones any day. So, like I said, they have really good thump and bass, really good highs, really even mids. These are perfect for watching movies, for playing games, for listening to music, of course. Um, pretty much all around, anything, even whether it's high hip hop, whether it's rock, whether it's classical, whether it's jazz, funk, any of that stuff, these headphones sound awesome. Very, very nice. I like these headphones enough that when the, some of the other guys on Buy Me an iPhone were asking me for, to test out these headphones for their review, I was telling them, nope, not gonna do it. These are my babies. I'm keeping these for myself. I'm gonna be selfish on this one just because that's how much I like using these. So when it comes to over ear headphones, these are the ones I've been using. These are the bad boys right here. I like them that much. Um, so yeah, audio quality is really good. And like I said, I've used them for everything, for listening to music, even for gaming on my computer, I've used them. Uh, for watching movies, it sounds awesome. Even if it's action movies with lots of loud sounds and everything like that, it's, everything sounds really good. So I think Scotia's done a really good job with these headphones. I'm, I'm really surprised, considering it's the first time they've released over-ear headphones. I can't wait to see what other ones they have to coming down the line. They did uh, have a, a new pair of these, and I'm not sure if I showed it in my video. I wasn't. I don't think I did it in my CES video, but they have a pair of Bluetooth ones coming out very soon, so I really hope to check those out because I'm really excited to see the audio quality on that and see how that goes. So Bluetooth one's coming out. I'm not exactly sure when that's going to be, if that's the end of this year or early next year, but uh, definitely something to check out. They also have a new pair of these uh, smaller ones that go uh, on-ear. So these are the over-ear, but they have a little bit smaller versions, the on-ear ones. Those are going to be released very soon, I think, at the end uh, or in the th third quarter, I think, is when it is. I'm not exactly sure, to be quite honest with you guys, but I know, I think it's on the website as well. You can check those out. So if you want to see more details about this or see the other products that Scotia has to offer, go check them out on their website. I'll put the, the, the link in the description below so you can jump on their website and see what else they have to offer. But uh, yeah, definitely high praise for me, guys. I definitely think you should, if you're looking for a really good pair of headphones, $200 and under for over-ear, and you want to check out something a little different from... The usual Beats by Dre and some of the other products or the other brands that are out there. Check out Scotia's RH1056. I think you'll like them a lot. So, guys, that's it for me today. Um, please post any questions you may have about this product below in the video, and I will do my best to get back to you. If you yourself personally own this product, I'd love to hear what you have to say. Do you agree with me on the, on the sound quality? Do you think they are comfortable and lightweight and everything that I've said in this video? If you don't think so, go ahead and post a comment below and tell us what you think about it, okay? Um, if you guys want to follow me on Twitter, you can do so at Omar Correa. If you want to follow us on the website, you can follow us at Buy Me an iPhone. So I'll see you guys in the next video review. Take care.